Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is David from Tech Review, and today I'm going to show you uh, Google Chrome 8 from the Dev Channel, and it has some nice new features that I want to show you. Okay, so here I've opened up Google Chrome. Looks just like normal, nothing really different. Then I'm going to type into my address bar about labs. Then we have a bunch of settings we can play around with. Let me zoom in. Um, we have side tabs, which basically just takes the tab bar and puts it on the side of the browser, which is good for widescreen monitors, I guess. Um, we have tab settings, which uh, takes the settings, the options dialog, and puts it into a tab, which I thought was pretty neat. Um, we have instant, which uses Google Instant Search in the address bar. I'm going to show you that one. Uh, remoting, I'm not sure what that is, but I guess it's something. Um, disable outdated plugins, which um, if there's an outdated plugin, like like something like that, um, it'll uh, disable it. Uh, X XSS uh, auditor, um, it's a cross-platform scripting protection, and it protects you from certain attacks on malicious sites. Uh, background web apps allows installed web apps to run in the background uh, system startup and will, and continue running after all windows are closed. GPU accelerated canvas 2D. I'm going to enable that. Um, it enables higher performance of canvas tags with a 2D context by rendering using uh, graphics processor unit hardware. Uh, what that basically means is it uses your GPU to render uh, HTML5 things like I'll show it to you once I restart okay so Chrome is restarted and now I'm going to uh, show you the asteroids benchmark and let it load here okay so press space to run at asteroids HTML5 canvas benchmark okay, test one okay as you can see we are getting, I'd say, around 40, maybe 30 FPS, which isn't that bad. Here, 20, 30. Yeah. We're just going to let this run here, and we'll see the results at the end of the benchmark. Okay, so benchmark score 1017, average frames per second 22. Uh, I ran this before and I got around maybe 33 or something. And that was without my screen capture tool. So obviously that makes a difference. Okay, well, thank you for watching and see you in the next one.